Hey guys, welcome to an all new episode of Things That Make Me Feel Like a Dick. We gotta be quiet today, okay, because I don't know what the fuck is going on. I woke up this morning, my hair, gone. Alright, I'm wearing these weird clothes and there's nothing outside those windows but white tile rooms. I have no idea where I am right now. Alright? Welcome back to the computer intelligence training. But I keep hearing these weird noises. You guys hear that? <laughs> what the hell is that? But we're gonna go on with the show. Alright? We're just gonna we're just gonna relax. Alright, we're gonna sit back, we're gonna talk at a normal level. And we're just gonna go on with the episode. Like, nothing is, oh my god, what the fuck is happening? Oh Help me. All right, I'm just gonna get right into this because I can't find a good segue, so here we go. Topic number one in today's episode has to deal with pickles. Everyone's favorite cucumbers in, in some water. Or something. <sighs> Am I the only person in the world who wants to smack the piss out of someone when they jubilantly walk up to me and say, I love pickle sauce. Wait a minute, not, not sauce. What is it? Uh, because that just sounds really gross. Pick, pick, pickle water? Pickle, pickle water? No. Uh, pickle juice. Pickle juice. Yeah, that's right, people do that. I wanna meet the guy that pioneered that fucking great idea, right? Was this fucking maniac just sitting around a picnic table one day like, shit, there's no more pickles. I guess I better just drink the juice out of the jar here to satisfy my incessant cravings for a big old brimming mouthful of dill. <laughs> and I know, I know, some of you guys out there are like, but Mike, pickle juice is delicious. What? 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 Some of you guys out there are looking at me like, Mike, have you ever tried pickle juice? No, I haven't. Because it sounds gross. I don't feel like puking, I don't feel like dying today, and I don't feel like having botulism. Maybe if I had some right now, I would try it for you. But fortunately, I don't. Yay! Well, here it is. This is the stuff that some of you people insist on drinking all the time. I know at least two or three people that like to drink this garbage. And I'm not talking just a sip. They will drink the whole jar. The whole jar. The whole jar. Oh my god. This is like drinking bath water. Look at it. It's like... Look at those little floaties in there. It's like got like whatever is going on. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. don't spill it. Don't spill it. Ah, ah, it's a strong smell. It's a strong scent of dill. Kosher dill toilet water. Put it in your mouth and try not to puke. I'm gonna take a nice big mouthful. See you, huh? You guys ready? Nice big gulp. Watch. I'm gonna get the glass on this side, right here in this region, so you can watch. That was unpleasant. Oh, never again. Never again. I'm gonna say this one time and one time only. Don't ever drink that, okay? Don't ever put that in your mouth. Don't ever even let it get near your face. I would rather kiss the belching mouth of a Taiwanese chain-smoking prostitute than open mouth kiss Jennifer Lawrence after she poured an entire jar of this dumpster swill down her throat. All right, let's move right into topic number two. <laughs> topic number two deals with something very near and dear to my heart. Video games. You guys all remember a time in gaming when your friends would come over to your house and plant their asses firmly into the furniture like a bunch of hippies trying to protect a forest full of lazy boys. Ah, yes. A glorious time. Back before the internet was populated with a bunch of 12-year-old turds all telling me that they gangbanged my mother before teabagging me into a violent pillow-punching bitch fit. Fucking douchebag! Teabag me again! Teabag me again! And back then, not everybody had their own controller because couch gaming was a lot more popular than online gaming. Shit, it was the only option. If you were a kid lucky enough to have two controllers, chances are, one, that second controller was probably a total piece of shit. 
And two, at 12 years old, there was no way you were gonna let your friend have the better controller and the competitive edge in a game of Mario Kart or Goldeneye. NOT A FUCKING CHANCE! But I always felt like a dick when I would hand my best friend the controller that had an analog stick looser than Lindsay Lohan's morals. It's morals, right? Yeah, morals. It's like giving somebody a broken big wheel and telling them to race you on the German Autobahn as you're stepping into a fully loaded Ferrari. 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 But the point is, we all know who's gonna win. And at the end of the game, the score would always kind of reflect who had the better controller anyway. You always had to play it down like your controller sucked too, right? Meanwhile, you're a lap and a half ahead of that poor sap with three red shells spinning around your car like rabid Rottweilers staring him in the face like, Go ahead. Pass me. I fucking dare you. And there's actually part of me that's a little pissed off about this entire subject. You're like, why, Mike? Aren't you talking about winning? Aren't you talking about you being the kid that had the better controller and now you're ahead and that kid behind you is the one getting fucked? Why am I so upset about that? Because I've been the friend before. I've been driven crazy one too many times by going over to people's houses and being handed the old busted, sticky button having, wiggly ass analog stick waving piece of shit controller to you dicks. Smells like a fart in here. Smells like a fart in here. Am I the only guy on the internet who wants to smack the piss out of people when they tell me they drink pickles? Fuck. I almost said pickle sauce. Pickle sauce. Ooh. Focus. Focus. Channeling the aliens of comedy. No, not chain smoking first. Taiwanese, then chain smoking. Taiwanese chain smoking. Taiwanese chain smoking. Chain smoking. Taiwanese. Taiwanese chain smoking. Taiwanese chainsaw.